What's up guys, today I have something very fun for you. Now, if you watched my last video, I did broke my clutch and the spring was snapped in half. So basically I replaced it with some flimsy spring, but that doesn't matter. Like now the, the clutch is literally like spaghetti. Uh, I don't feel it. Anyways, we're gonna do something very fun today. We're gonna do throttle only. So getting back to basics, you know, having some fun actually, going back to the old days, like practicing a specific skill set modulating the throttle and stuff like that and i hope you guys can learn something you know and also enjoy the video all right i'm ready so we're gonna put it in second gear we'll be using weight transfer throttle steering and just modulating the throttle so we have to have a good throttle input gotta be careful with what angle do we make so we don't want to hit the walls and we don't want to stall the engine so we gotta be careful as well this car doesn't have too much horsepower keep this in mind so have to be careful I'm gonna flick the wheel, keep the throttle in, keep the throttle so we don't kill the car. Come on, careful. I'm modulating the throttle every time I give gas, it's like I'm correcting the angle. So I also steer myself, and as well, I'm applying some throttle steering. So, careful. You see me steering to the to the right? I steer gas, steer gas. That's basically how you throttle steer. And we'll flick. Gonna adjust. You see how small corrections I'm doing? That's just throttle, fellas. That is just throttle. You can literally practice this yourself. It's a very good practice for just your throttle skill and uh, how you modulate and how you just control the car overall with just throttle. Nothing else, not even brake. Careful, now we're gonna let the, the wheel flick and I knew that I'm gonna jump immediately into a big angle But this comes with experience of your own wheel and uh, what happens careful with the oh We almost hit the rail there gotta be careful. Oh, we need some momentum because the car started dying You can definitely flick the car into a very big angle like now I did two times But you see what happens else if you flick the car the car is gonna go into this massive angle and uh, you won't have the momentum enough to keep riding the rail, right? So drift playground for me, if you're not riding the rails, you're doing something wrong, definitely. So it's all about riding the rails, but as well as we don't have the brakes to uh, kind of secure myself, to stay on the line, ride the rails, it's like very hard to stay, to stay on them in general. So I'm trying my best just to stick on the lines, right? You can definitely do like this, flick the car a bit, try to mimic something. Oh, that was very hard, like so many corrections here. But you see, this is super fun, just to challenge yourself, to practice your throttle skills. Uh, can you do throttle steering? Can you flick the car? Boom! Stay on the line, stay on the line. Don't die on me, please. Again. Oh, we tapped the wall. I, I could literally feel it through the wheel. Careful, careful, we're very close. Whoop. Careful now with the throttle because we have to adjust the angle. Look again. Careful. Let it flick. Careful. Full throttle in. Flick. Then let off the gas. Let it grip up. You give the gas. Once the car is looking where you want it, then you can give the gas valves. So, for example, Full throttle in, wait, the car looks forward, now gas. So basically that's that else. You see, it's very fun actually to challenge yourself. Oh yeah, this is not gonna happen without the clutch. This is definitely not happening, okay. <laughs> okay, I mean I have to try guys, <laughs> to try and see what's gonna happen, you know. But yeah, it's definitely super fun to practice specific skills you know practice braking like if you especially like i'm trying to help you guys learn the stuff definitely gonna jump into uh drift guys but i guess they'll have to be delayed since the clutch is busted i hate this flimsy clutch it's spaghetti zero to like when i press it it's like either zero or either hundred like uh, i can't modulate now i literally can't modulate the clutch because it's super light for me i'm not used to it uh i can definitely use it for some videos but anyways not gonna prolong this video uh, i hope you learned something definitely if you need some help uh, learning my best advice for you is practice specific skills leave one day once you learn how to modulate throttle move on to the clutch 
leave just one day practicing clutch kicks holding the clutch to grip up straight out if you over steer or something happens to hold to catch the angles and stuff like that then leave one day for breaks once you master that and stuff like that and it's obviously it's gonna it's not gonna happen in one day but anyways if you like this video check out the tune it's gonna be on patreon please like the video guys it really helps it push the algorithm on it being promoted i really appreciate it if you like what i'm posting subscribe uh jump in our discord and for now fellas wish you all the best and we'll see you in the next video